Explain more about the eclipse and who's in the path. Look, the pressure has been on. I feel like every time I see you, all we're talking about is, uh -huh. are we going to be able to see this eclipse? Uh, you know, I will get to the forecast, yeah, but I got to say, it's not looking great for uh, the cloud cover in the area, which will be a shame because we won't see something like this for over 300 years. <sighs> at least here in Dallas. <laughs> uh, but let me go ahead and show you. Let's talk about what it is. We've been talking about the eclipse and simply put, it's basically just a big shadow. This is when the moon positions itself between the Earth and the sun. So when that happens in this particular orbit, it's going to block out the entirety of the sun. So we'll be perfectly in that shadow uh, during the early afternoon on April 8th. And this is going to cast really a shadow across a big swath of North America, including Mexico, including areas of Texas and everyone in Texas with clear skies hoping uh, will be in the path of at least a partial eclipse. But the total eclipse is going to go over the Texas Hill Country and over a big portion of the Metroplex, including most of Tarrant County. There'll be a very small sliver in northwestern Tarrant County that only sees uh, the partial eclipse. So we'll talk a little bit more about the forecast here in the next hour, but unfortunately, it's looking a little cloudy a week from today. Back to you. All right.